What is going on amazing beautiful people your boy Jeffrey Gamer is back at you with another GTA 5 tutorial and today guys and gals we're going to be doing a map a map mod by request uh, torment requested that we do a Burger King specifically the one down near the beach I knew there was one there I could not find it anywhere. Um, as a matter of fact all of the Burger King Y map add-ons that I found were all deleted they weren't available for download so um, I did find a really cool McDonald's one um, so that's the one we're going to install torment. I hope this is, this is, uh, you know, good enough for you, um, or anybody that's coming here to look to install this. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to show you how to install it, how to uninstall it in case it, you know, breaks your game or makes you, cr makes you crash, or you just simply don't like it. And of course we're going to go into the game and check it out. So with that being said, let's get started. First thing you want to do is click the link down below that says McDonald's. Big shout out to Big Dog. And you can see a picture here. It does look pretty cool. It's got a drive through and everything. Um, it Usually these these map mods have a picture of where it is on the map, but um, you know, I think I might know where this is. I played the game enough. Um, this all looks familiar. You got the parking garage there and I can see the Weasel News building. So I think I know where this is and the construction site. So yes, and we can get in a helicopter. We'll find it. Um, so what you wanna do is click download there and then click download right there. Oops, right there. And it is going to download pretty quick. Let's minimize our web browser. And we have our WinRAR right there. Now we want to fire up our Open IV. And click Windows. I think this is going to be a pretty cool mod. I really do. Uh, there we go. And let's set that there. All right. Make sure you are in edit mode. If you always want it to, if you want your Open IV to load up in edit mode automatically, go to Tools click options and right here under default work mode yours might say read only just select that and click edit and then close that way every time you open up your open iv you're automatically in edit mode um all right so let's get started here folks uh double click in the winrar the mcdonald's folder there and you see you've got these these uh four files right here and then how to install so what we're going to do is we're going to create a folder right here on your desktop new folder and you're going to name it like remove McDonald's, okay? And this is to back up your files in case you don't like it. So double click this how to install, come on, there we go. And it'll give you the pathway, uh, McDonald's in little sill. So we have two places that we want to install these files. So the first one is going to be time 64, uh, and that looks like L. Is that time 64 L, I believe? Okay, so here's the pathway right there that we wanna follow for the first one. So we're gonna click mods, time 64 L, which is right here. Double click that. Levels, GTA 5 underscore city w korea town and then kt1 underscore lod uh kt1 underscore lod right there double click that so here we have uh some files here. Now, I'm wondering if we just install the KT1 LOD in here, and then these three go to this pathway, which I think is probably how it's done. So, here's what you're gonna wanna do. Um, you are going to want to go to your favorites and click add to favorites, and you're gonna name this McDonald's KT1 LOD. And hit add. Okay. And now you can see in the WinRAR, you've got these four files here. We want this KT1 underscore LOD underscore slot 2 YTD. As you see, we got this one right here. All right. This is the one that we're going to be changing. Um, and this is the one that's got the uh the, the the building so this is the file right here y'all 
that you want to left click and drag that up here and drop it in okay again you want this one make sure they match this one with this one and they match see that they match if you have to wait is that slot two or slot four i just did the slot four okay my bad we don't want slot four delete that out of there you want the slot two i'm sorry so kt1 underscore lod underscore slot two since that's the one that's right here see that's got the uh the uh the two next to it so see that so you want to take this and drag it up and drop it in okay now we can take this kt1 and now drag it on over and drop that in you should see this number right here change so now if we double click it um you should see uh this might just be this is just the outside uh but this is going to be the exterior it's not going to be the actual mcdonald's store itself i believe i believe those are going to be the other ones okay so let's say you want to remove this okay you're going to go to your favorites and you're going to go to the mcdonald's kt1 lod okay and you're going to see this file right here this is going to be the one we put it'll bring you right here you would then open up your backups right here and you would take the kt1 lod slot 2 ytd and you would drag that in and drop it that will remove this mcdonald's file that we just put in okay keeping that folder there okay we now in your open iv you want to double click mods right here again and bring you back to the beginning and bring up our instructions so now we want to go to this pathway and that is going to be mods again times 64 l levels gta5 underscore city w koreatown01 and now we want to go to kt1 underscore 12 right there kt1 underscore 12 double click that so this is where we want to be for this one now this is what you're going to want to do go to favorites again click add to favorites and name this uh mcdonald's 2 Oops, I always hit enter. You got to click add. Um, so now we've got both of them saved. You know, you got McDonald's KT1 Lod, and then you've got McDonald's 2, which we probably could have renamed it uh, KT1 underscore 12. So you could name it that if you'd like to make it more easier to remember. So now here we got the, the KT underscore KT1 underscore 12 down here. So you want to look at these kt1 underscore 12 underscore lod which is right here kt1 underscore 12 underscore lod ytd so we know we're going to take that file to back it up put it in the remove mcdonald's folder next one we have right here is the kt1 underscore 12 underscore shop which is underscore 12 underscore shop which is this one drag that one up and drop that one in and then lastly you have kt1 underscore 12 underscore shop plus high dr dot ytd so it's going to be this one right above it kt1 12 shop high dr ytd take that one up and drop it in i know it seems confusing guys but just follow these exact steps and you'll be good to go so now we should have in our backup folder four files and there's the four files and those four files are the original GTA files, all right? And we got four files here, so we're good. So now, in your WinRAR, you are going to select all these K these three KT1 underscore 12 files, not the LOD one. We already installed that one. You want the underscore 12 ones. Drag those in, and once we drop them, you should see these numbers right here change. So we're going to drop them. And then, boom, you've seen this one change, right? So now, if we double click these, this should be more of the McDonald's uh, building. Um, so we got the KT112, the LOD gives you Snickers. Um, there's the ground, the wall, right? So this is where uh, you're gonna see a lot of the, um, 
yeah, there you go. Yep, there's the McDonald's signs, the nuggets, all that. So we know it's in there. Okay, so we're done with the WinRAR. We are done with these instructions. Again, let's say I just fired, you don't want this in your game. I just fired up my open IV. This is how you're gonna completely remove it out of your game. Go to favorites, McDonald's, KT1 LOD, you click that, okay? And then you would open up your remove McDonald's folder and there is your KT1 LOD. You would take that, drag it, drop it in here. This is only if you wanna remove this McDonald's. You would drop it in there, right? Then that would be replaced. That would be reset back to default. Then you would go to favorites, click McDonald's 2, or if you named it KT1 underscore 12, right? And then it would bring you right here. And then you would take these underscore 12 files and drag those three files in and drop them in there. And then McDonald's will be completely removed out of your game and you are good to go. Um, so let's exit out of our file explorer. We are going to put this folder over here on the other monitor for safekeeping. We can exit out of OpenIV. Folks, let's jump into the game. Let's check it out. I'll see y'all in there. All right, folks, here we are in the game. First test, pass with flying colors, no crash, no nothing like that. Um, so there's the McDonald's, and for reference, because they don't show the map on the download page, it's going to be right where it says 732. So it's going to be right here on the corner of Vespucci and Palomino. Um, if I zoom out, it's going to be this part of the, of the map. So take a picture of that, mental note, whatever you got to do. Uh, and one thing I'm noticing is it is not a uh, interactive interior. Um, as a matter of fact, it says it says opening soon. I'm not really sure what used to be here, uh, to be honest with you. But I thought this was a working interior. It is not. You cannot go in there. Um, it does not have see-through glass. It just kind of looks like this. I don't know, maybe like it's boarded up. Um, I don't know. I don't know if I'm a big fan. For those that are looking at this part of the video before installing it, I will leave it up to you on if you want to uh, install this. Oh, look at that. Everything's free. It's all free. Wow. So uh, I'm going to be honest with you. I will put out this video. I'm kind of hesitant on putting it out because I really thought it was a working uh restaurant but it's not so uh but i will i will release this because maybe somebody just wants it for the aesthetics right because that's that's all this is folks this is purely aesthetics um you cannot go in the building um I, this should have changed the billboard right here too it did so you got big beefy bliss um right there uh it did change um oh it's got a samsung galaxy uh it it did change some things around here um as far as window signs and that of course that billboard so aesthetically i mean the sign is pretty dope you can see the sign up there and you know if we go to uh time and we put it on evening you could see the sign is is nice and lit up so that looks pretty cool uh, the McDonald's building is lit up. So, uh, this is my tutorial GTA folder. Uh, I don't think I will be putting this in my main LSPDFR folder. Um, but somebody might want to. So, I will release this video. Um, and in the meantime, I will continue to look for a working interior. Um, I am going to create a playlist because I have a bunch of map mods out there. I am going to create a playlist where it's going to have all map mod videos uh, and interior videos. So that should be pretty cool. Uh, but this is it. Again, Torment, I I, ah, I hope this is okay. Like this McDonald's isn't even open yet. Not a big fan of it. But like I said, I will release this video because I'm sure there's somebody out there. Uh, there's somebody out there that will, uh, that will dig uh, this McDonald's. So... Um, yeah, I hope this video was helpful to you. If it was and you're new here, 
please consider supporting the channel by hitting that subscribe button and ringing that bell so you know when new videos are dropped and also consider giving this video a thumbs up the more thumbs up this video gets the more people it can reach and teach as it hopefully did with you until next time everybody be safe be healthy be positive follow the rules and obey the law your boy jeffrey gamer is out we'll see you on the next one later y'all